I'm Paul Ryder. I own the house at 360 South 3rd Street that I restored. Well, this house, believe it or not, I bought it 20 years ago about and let it sit for 20 years because I had several other projects going on and finally got back to it because it's going to be my retirement home. And we went clear through the house, completely gutted it, got knob and tube wiring, you know, galvanized pipe for plumbing and things. And we just went through and just completely redid the house from top to bottom, really. That's what we did here. This house was built by Ira Mix. He was a banker here in town at the time, and he built it when him and his wife first got married in 1923, and they moved into the house. And it was sold to Bill Nix that has restored some houses also in town. They did a little bit of work and used this as a rental, and then eventually sold it to um, Lucille Van Wart Hill. She's from the Hill family. And she decided, you know, always when she was gone, that she wanted me to have this home. And so the family honored that when she passed away. We had the house appraised at that time and I bought it from the family. I try as much as I can, like all the trim work, the moldings and stuff like that, I take it all off by hand and number each piece. And then like the baseboards are the original baseboards in the house and the trim around the doors and things, but we refinish them, you know and kept it as much as possible as the original house you can. There's, like I said, did some changes, like modernize the kitchen, of course, and things like that. But more or less, it's pretty much the way it was. So, you know, the bathrooms and the kitchen and things, you have to upgrade on these old homes. When I first moved here, people say, why do you want to buy a place in Independence? And it was a pretty rough town at that time. There wasn't much future at, going on, but over the God, 40 years I've been here, it's turned around completely, you know. We got the wonderful Riverview Park and the hotel down there and the walk going along the river and things. So I walk that every morning with my dog and then my family's here too. My daughter lives across the street from me and my parents used to live across the street also, so I wouldn't go no place else.